Okay, assalamualaikum and hi everyone. Okay, in this video, I will show you the answer for question number 10 for uh, from the trial PSPM set number 2. Okay, so question number 10A, calculate the binding energy per nucleon for tellium okay, in MeV per nucleon. Okay, given atomic mass. Okay, so first we need to calculate the mass defect. Okay, the mass defect which is okay, the mass of proton plus mass of nu neutron minus the mass of nucleus. Okay, but in this question, okay, they, they don't give you the mass of the nucleus. But uh, instead you are given the atomic mass. Okay, the atomic mass. Okay, so in order to calculate the mass of nucleus, okay, so we can uh, take the mass of the atom minus mass of the electron. Okay. Okay, so and then we substitute. Okay, so number of proton is 81. Mass of proton. Okay, so this mass of proton, you just follow from the list of constant. Okay, plus with uh, number of neutron okay number of neutron 205 minus 81 is 124 times with uh, mass of neutron okay and then minus with uh, the mass of nucleus okay so mass of nucleus we need to calculate mass of atom minus mass of electron okay so mass of atom is given 204.974401 okay minus number of electron is 81 mass of electron okay mass of electron 5.9 times 10 power negative 4 okay so that gives you the mass defect in the unit atomic mass unit 1.734 okay 1.734 u and then uh, we want to calculate the binding energy per nucleon. Okay, so binding energy is uh, mass defect 1.734 times with 931.5. Okay, uh, so that will give you the binding energy in uh, mega electron volt. Okay, and then we divide by number of nucleon. Okay, number of nucleon which is 205. Okay, 205. Okay, so that gives you the final answer 7.88 mega electron volt per nucleon. Okay, so for the uh, marking, so one mark, one mark is given for concept. Okay, K1 for concept, uh, concept for the mass of nucleus. Okay, so if you calculate mass of nucleus as uh, the mass of atom minus the mass of electron. Okay, so this one is one mark okay and then another one mark for gantian gantian one mark gantian means uh, the whole uh, okay the whole uh, gantian for mass defect okay so whole of this must be correct okay so one mark for gantian and then one mark for concept okay another concept is for binding energy Binding energy per nucleon. Okay, so one mark given for uh, this concept. And finally, one mark for gantian jawapan and unit. Okay, gantian jawapan unit. That means the gantian for mass defect. Uh, 931.5 divided by 205. Okay, so this part is gantian. Jawapan is 7.88. Unit is MeV per nucleon. Okay, uh, so gantian jawapan unit one mark. Okay, so all of this is one mark. Okay, and then for question 10b, radioactive nuclei has half life of 0 0.99 second. Determine the time taken for 25% of the nuclei to decay away. 
Okay, so if 25% of the nuclei has decayed, so uh, the number of nuclei left is 75%. Okay, because 25% is already decayed. Okay, so now the number of nuclei left is 75%. 75% from the uh, initial number of nuclei. Okay, so uh, remember the formula N is equals to N naught exponent negative power of negative lambda T. Okay, so uh, now we want to find the time, the time taken for uh, the, the nuclei to decay by 25%. Okay, so another information that we need to calculate is the decay constant. Okay, so decay constant, uh, so it's given half-life. Okay, so we can calculate decay constant using the formula. Half um, decay constant is equal to ln 2 over half-life. Okay. Okay, so decay constant is long 2 over half-life. Half-life is 0 0.99 second. Okay, so we get the decay constant is 0 0.5, eh, sorry, 0 0.7 per second. Okay, and then uh, we substitute into this formula. N equals N naught exponent negative lambda T. Okay, where now the number of nuclei is uh, 0 0.75 from initial number of nuclei okay so we substitute n is 0 0.75 and not okay so now we can cancel and not okay exponent power of 0 0.7 the decay constant times t okay uh, and then uh, just uh, uh, to remove the exponent we just put ln Long on both sides. Negative 0 0.7 T. Okay. And then calculate and we get the answer. Time is 0 0.41 second. Okay. So for the marks. Okay. So one mark is given for concept. Okay. Concept one mark. Which is N equals to 0 0.75 and not. Okay. And then another one mark for gantian. Okay. Gantian means... Uh, for this part, ln 2 divided by 0 0.99. Okay, ln 2 divided by 0 0.99. So you get one mark for gantian in this part. Okay, and last one, marks for gantian jawapan unit. Okay, so gantian jawapan unit. Okay, gantian is this one, 0 0.75. Okay, okay, for this part is gantian jawapan unit for final answer 0 0.41 second so this one is jawapan and unit okay so all of this is one mark okay all of this part is one mark gantian jawapan and unit okay so that's for question number 10